Hello, it's Shem Games here once again. Today we are going to add the heartbeat animation to the blood screen so it looks a lot better. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, first we have to go to the HUD folder and to the player HUD. Let's open it. And we want to go to the graph and find some empty space and create a custom event. Custom event. And let's call it, um, for example, heart, heartbeat anim play sample or just heartbeat animation or anim okay that's good for me now let's first add a branch to here now we want to get the spp first person character and from here bpc get bpc health like this and from here we want to get health current and health max now from these we want to check if the oh sorry if the health current is less than the health max okay if it's less than the health max then the branch should be uh, true and from true we want to um actually let's play animation like this and now we can just leave it like that and then from here from uh from these two values actually let's move these a little bit here and from here we want to divide and let's divide it with the max look like this and now from here we want to map range clamped like this and the value should be a should be zero and b should be one and now we want to uh, like turn those around so the first one is I will make two and this point five I think these were good values for me and now we want to connect this to the playback speed okay now we also want to copy this connect it to here and we want to connect this same value to here like this these values for me uh, actually we don't have to we don't have to do anything to toast yet we can do it later let's just leave it there okay now we want to, after this, we want to add a delay. The delay time should be. Um, okay, now actually we have to go to the designer. We have to create the animation. Okay, add, let's add an animation. Let's call it heartbeat anim or just heartbeat. Okay, heartbeat. Now let's add a track. And the track should be actually we can just do it like this. Let's click the blood screen and the, this, and now we can add the blood screen to here. Now from here we want to add a transform. Let's open it and scale. Okay. Now we want to uh, we want to click this scale this plus here on the scale. Now we want to move it to. 0.15 and we want to change these values to 1.015 and 1.015 like this and now let's go to the 0 0.3 now let's change this back to 1 and 1 okay now let's go to the point uh, 45 and from here I want to change this to 0 0. Uh, 1.02 like this 1.02 now let's go to the oh it was on sorry 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 we want to go to the 0 0.45 sorry sorry about that I will remove this 0 0.45 now let's change this back to 1 okay uh, no 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 sorry I don't know what I'm doing we want to change this 1.02 1 1.02 so First we have 1, 1.015, 1, 
1.02. Now to the 0.6, we want to change this back to 1. Okay. Now let's go to the 1 second to here. And let's just click this and enter and enter. Or you can just click here from the on the scale. This Now it looks like, you can see, it does like two heartbeats. Okay. This animation is ready. Now we can go back to graph. <coughs> and now we want to go here to the animation, get this heartbeat, and connect this to here to the animation. Now we want to get this heartbeat animation again. And we want to get end time like this. And we want to divide this value. Divide. And we want to divide this value with. Uh, uh, value that we get from here. Okay, now let's move this a little bit more here. Like I will align this quickly. Okay, now it looks better. And now we just want to connect this value to the duration. So what it what this does is it checks if the health current is less than the health max. Then we can play this animation. And this play rate is, uh, if our health is zero or near zero, it's two times the play speed. And if it's uh, near max, it's 0 0.5 times. So lower the health, the higher the heartbeat. So, you know, okay. And now from here, we want to check if our play speed is two. We want to divide this end time with the two value. So it uh, like splits it to half. So delay is always the same as this animation. Okay. Now from here, after this anyways animation, we want to call this same custom event again. So heart beat oh heart beat anim like this. Okay. And every time the health has got back to the max, it cuts because there are nothing on the false. Okay. Everything should be fine here. And now we actually have to go to the blueprints folder and to the PP uh, first person character. Now we want to find this, our event on land. And we can actually do one more thing here. We want, can, um, let's create a new custom event, custom event. And I want to call it all damage like that or actually I can put a space there fall damage now we can cut this link so alt and left click and we can move all this a little bit more here and from here we have to call this fall damage fall damage like maybe now we want to connect this to the remove health and I will move this a little bit more up maybe like this and like that okay now we have just this looks a little bit more more like it looks better and we heard we have more space so we don't have to start that function from uh, or this function from there now we can just call it from here from the sequence and we have all the space here but yeah, now after this uh, set restore health. Oh, sorry, not after this set restore health, but after the components and the PPC health. And here is the function health remove. We want to add a little uh, code here. And it should be like we have to get all widget of class. This. and the class is player hot uh, here we want to get and which can just leave it to zero and now we have to compile or it doesn't work now that we have compiled we can get from here heart heart beat anim like this now we can just connect it here and i will actually re add a reroute pin here or maybe two then this okay now it looks better now let's check if it works or if i uh, forgot something
um, this is not working, I don't know why. Let's try again. Now it works, okay? Now let's check how it looks. If we jump from here, now you can see the plus screen has heartbeat animation. And the lower the health you can see, the faster it is. So when we get more health, the heartbeat goes uh, slower. So like if we have like 10 health, it's almost two times the uh, normal play speed. So it's like 120, 120 uh, bits per second. So like this, now it's pretty fast. And you can see when the health goes up, you can see it goes much slower. That you know, I think it looks pretty good. And yeah, this was just a quick video, and in the next episode we will start adding some camera shakes and stuff like that. So if you did enjoy this tutorial, please click the like button and uh, subscribe if you want to see some more. And yeah, see you in the next one. Bye.